Join us as we discover new frontiers in medicine and science that is changing lives one patient at a time. New medical innovations improve our lives, break barriers, and provide a brighter future. Join me as we discover these together. The spine is one of the most important parts of the body. Not only does the spine protect your spinal cord, but also serves as a foundation for your bone structure. Statistics show 3% of the population suffers from a disease called scoliosis. Scoliosis is a curvature and a rotational deformity of the spine. Not only can this condition cause a tremendous amount of pain, but in some cases progress to the point of fatality. Scoliosis is a progressive disease that if not treated can get worse over time. Scoliosis is just a general term that means curvature of the spine. It's like we drive a car, but there are many types of cars. Well, there are many types of scoliosis. As the scoliosis develops and progresses, it, it has uh, three components. It's got a, a sideways curve in the spine, causes a rotary uh, problem in the spine, which causes the rib hump that we're familiar with in seeing the patients with scoliosis. Well, the key to early treatment is early diagnosis. And that be usually begins in the primary care physician's office and doing something called an Adams forward bend test and just looking for a uh, lack of symmetry of the back. Today, we are privileged to learn about a medical procedure at Nicholas Children's Hospital that's given children a brighter future. Dr. Shufflebarger, a worldwide expert in spinal deformity care, is changing lives one child at a time with state-of-the-art orthopedic procedures that's combating the effects of scoliosis. The, the treatment choices for scoliosis, in my view, are really only three, and that's watching it, which is really doing nothing, uh, surgery, which is reserved for more severe cases, and bracing. And bracing is indicated for small to moderate-sized curves in children who are growing with the goal to prevent it from getting worse. So bracing has been shown to change the natural history or what happens to the untreated curves about two-thirds of the time, and that being to keep it from getting worse. It's not a corrective factor. Nothing else, uh, exercises, uh, manipulation, and anything you can imagine has been tried, but there's no scientific evidence that anything else will change the natural history. During our visit with Dr. Shufflebarger, we learned that families should know the options they have when making a decision on an orthopedic surgery for their children. There are several surgical choices and options to consider. Dr. Shufflebarger makes these recommendations specific for each child and explains safety factors on how he feels each patient can be served best. Scoliosis surgery is a major undertaking, uh, particularly for the family and, and the patient. And we approach spinal surgery as a, as a team event. And uh, the team consists of the surgeon and his assistants, uh, the anesthesiologist who sh should have some expertise in anesthesia for scoliosis surgery, which is different than anesthesia for a lot of other things. Uh, the spinal cord monitoring team should be led by a physician and have a good relationship with both the surgeon and the anesthesiologist. And finally, the nursing team in the operating room uh, we feel should be consistent and the same so the procedure goes seamlessly. In addition to Dr. Shufflebarger, the hospital has an incredible staff of doctors and nurses that oversee every procedure and care for every patient that's treated in orthopedic surgery. This comprehensive staff of doctors and nurses are responsible for performing over 1,400 orthopedic surgeries every year. Each doctor and staff member in orthopedic care play a huge role in the success of every patient's outcome. This gives each patient the opportunity to live a normal life and has a huge effect on their self-esteem. Parents have joy and peace knowing this surgery has completely changed their child's life. As individuals or organizations continue to improve the world, we will be here. Until next time, this is William Shatner, signing off.